Hi, welcome. Christian Dior, La Collection Privée ou Dispahan. Um, <laughs> I have uh, fallen hard for this scent. It is amazing, extraordinary. Um, I did not know. I didn't. I had no idea. I stumbled upon it really. Um, <laughs> this is a rose oud composition. To me, it is uh, such a such a captivating, bewitching scent. Um, it it's rose, but it's more than rose. It's smoky. It has a sort of earthy quality, like a soily soily quality as well. Um, it has some soft animalic. You know, this is to my nose. If you're familiar with uh, leather oud, it's a rosy leather oud. And when I say rosy, the rose in it is has got a a sweet and tart and jammy and uh, syrupy quality. I also detect some sort of um, like a sort of wispy, ghostly berry note. I, I sense that in here as well. Um, and uh, I, I really crave the scent. I mean, for me, the idea of finishing up my day, coming home, having a bath, and applying some of this is heaven. It is heaven. I think the scent is so versatile. I think it could be used for any, any event, any function, any occasion. Um, for me, this is what I call a top shelf masterpiece. I love it. Uh, I, I think it's suitable for both genders. I love it on me and I think it smells very alluring and sensual and sexy on a man. Um, I, I, <laughs> I hope you've gotten yourself a sandwich and a beverage because I mean I could just go on and on but I will spare you I will spare you and, and try to uh, stick to the program here. Um, performance. Performance is stellar. Longevity is outer-worldly. Projection, I think, is, is excellent. I think it's excellent projection. Um, there is nothing I don't like about this scent. Absolutely nothing. And usually I'm, I, I just pick a scent apart. That's just what I do. I, I've done it forever, for nobody but myself, really. But I, I, I attempt to do so with this one, and no, nope, can't do it because there's nothing not good about it. This, this scent to me is just uh, part of the reason why it's so captivating. I think is because the the smoke, the rose, that syrupy kind of berry quality, the, the woodsiness, which I understand is um, oud wood smoke or oud wood chips or something like that. Well, they all kind of, kind of mingle within the composition and they dance for you. Sometimes I think, wow, it's, it's quite smoky. And then the rose weaves back in and sings to me. I absolutely love the scent. I think you could not go wrong. I would not recommend blind buying it only because I think it's rather polarizing because uh, my sweetheart does not care for this. He does not care for leather oud. He does not care for this. In fact, sometimes when I have this on, um, I'll, you know, shove my wrist to his nose and he'll be like, leather oud. And really, it's it's not leather oud. It's oud ispahan, but that's what he picks up. So no, don't do not blind buy it. Um, but I love it. 
I love it. It's, it's got to be in my top five. Top five top shelf masterpieces. For your consideration, Christian Dior's Oud Ispahan.